Mike Bertrells out of Florida. Thanks, Mike. Wow. Okay, here's uh, Ronnie Jones out of El Centro with a uh, B25 twin engine. These are pretty good size engines in this. Retractable gear. First the brakes and the flaps. It works. Again, a lot of history with the B-25, World War II. Except the music down, let you listen to those twin engines humming along. For those that have never really flown these, you know, these scale models like this, uh, they'll fly just like the full scale. The same idiosyncrasies, the same stalling type tactics, the same maneuvers, uh, whatever the big ones do, that's the same way these small ones will have a tendency to do. Jim Labarge, you got a couple of people at the registration stand. You want to check over there, Jim? Again, we'd like to remind you we have a big air show coming up here, I think on February 21st or so. It's on a Saturday, and this is just kind of a little preview of what you'll see that day. There'll be a lot more planes and a variety of things. Uh, so keep in mind that in February, guys have been, have been working on that air show already, so we uh, appreciate it.
rain. What else is it? I don't know where the front comes to. Got the gear down on it. Getting the landing pattern. And on the downwind leg. <laughs> yep, coming back from a training mission. Back in the 40s. Jimmy Doolittle and his Raiders. I actually worked for a company out of Anoka, Minnesota, Cornelius Company, and they they designed the uh, Bombay doors, the hydraulics on that, and when, they, when Doolittle made his raids, he pulled his B-25 down and said, I want that Cornelius one in there. We know that they work, so the guy that owned the plant we had was pretty proud of that. Let's he, talk about that. Anyway, the B-25, twin engine, here we come. And we're down. All right, let's give him a nice hand. Beautiful landing. From El Centro, Ronnie. Dave, uh, is Dave going to do our flag one now? Dave, Dave Moline's out of the Livingston, Montana.